Meghan Markle facing Valentine's Day alone as Prince Harry plans trip to Arctic Circle. Meghan Markle faces the prospect of spending Valentine's Day alone with Prince Harry planning a visit to the Arctic Circle. The Duke of Sussex will be spending this Valentine's Day with Royal Marines, who are being trained in survival in the extreme cold in Norway's frigid north. Prince Harry may be reunited with his pregnant wife, the Duchess of Sussex, in the evening but will spend the most romantic day of the year meeting troops who are taking part in exercise clockwork. Exercise clockwork is the traditional name for the grueling annual winter training, based in one of the world's most demanding environments. Set 200 miles inside the Arctic Circle, more than 16,000 Royal Marines and Royal Navy sailors and airmen have taken part since 1969. Harry's visit marks the 50th anniversary of Commando Helicopter Force and Joint Helicopter Command deploying to Bardafoss in Norway. Military personnel are taught how to survive, operate and fight in the sub-zero conditions and gain experience of operating aircraft in severe cold weather and mountainous environments. The multinational exercise, hosted by the Norwegian Armed Forces, comprises environmental flying qualifications, cold weather survival, tent group commander and snow and ice driving courses. The Duke, in his role as Captain General Royal Marines, will fly to the air station in Bardafoss on February 14 to meet military personnel living and training across six months of the year on the base. Harry will also see field tents snow vehicles and a Quincy shelter, a makeshift shelter built of snow in which the elite forces are able to camp. It is the Duke and Duchess's first Valentine's Day as a married couple. Kensington Palace said on Twitter this morning, the Duke of Sussex, Captain General at Royal Marines, will visit Exercise Clockwork to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the operation in Bardafoss. Norway on Thursday 14 February. Clockwork is the traditional name of the annual winter exercise, based in one of the world's most demanding environments 200 miles inside the Arctic Circle, which has trained over 16,000 at Royal Marines and at Royal Navy sailors and airmen since 1969. The Duke of Sussex will meet military personnel living and training on the base view some of the specialist outdoor severe weather equipment and training that is conducted at clockwork and talk with expert air crews and engineers. The Duke of Sussex was appointed Captain General at Royal Marines in December 2017, succeeding the Duke of Edinburgh who held the appointment for 64 years. This will be the Captain General's first visit to Joint Helicopter Command.